sight from them. Will not stop me. How pathetic. Use the force, Cal. We find on the roof. How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to more of our Fallen Survivor series. It is time to take on Dagangera. <clears throat> there he is. Dagan, your time has come. a few years too late. If Santari had only stood with me, we could have convinced the council that Tanilor was worth the sacrifice. Now she's gone. Ravis is gone. The Order is gone, and I am free! You're not free, Dagon. You're alone. Why are you here when your true enemy is out there? How could you let the galaxy fall to this unworthy machine of an empire? You think yourself a survivor, but you are a failure! They haven't beaten us. Not yet. Now who is blinded by the past? Within the Abyss, the Empire cannot reach us. I will forge these raiders into an elite army led by disciples trained in the Force at my temple. Then, when the time is right, I will strike out and cleanse this galaxy with fire. Oh. We've already got an Emperor. Give us the compass. And why would I do that? Because I'm a father who's running out of options. And you're standing in the way of a better life for my little girl. You hand it over. I will put you down. What Ooh. small dreams you cling to. Enough! Tunnel or beckons. Here we go. <clears throat> <laughs> Shoot him! You're fading. Still chained by the past. Huh. It will be your grave. Oh, God. Come on. And for that, she betrayed me. You're an embarrassment. Die. A little help, buddy. And me. Tunnel is mine. Lining up a 
Come on. <clears throat> I think he was pretty much a missing for that entire section you then. Will not stop me. Okay. How pathetic. Use the force, Cal. Oh God. Are you fine on the roof? Supposed to jump to dodge that? Is that it? Hey, buddy, face me. Bow before me, Jedi. Is that it? Just die. Just one final act. Fight me. No, you don't. Buddies, help. Pathetic. Give me a sim. You will suffer more then. Pathetic. You're an embarrassment. Your demise is inevitable. I could have you in the galaxy would never know this. Where's he gone? Get him! Is that it? I'm simply not. Shit. Viv here! You cannot escape this. You're terrified. You perish. Okay. You're finished. Okay, I think we got him, thank God. That was close. How does it feel to know that you're about to die? That your life meant nothing? Don't resist. You can't hide from me. Ah, oh, yes. I feel it. Loss, suffering, shame, anger. There is immense power in such emotions, but you were the too side. weak. And now it's too late. Hey, what? Shuttles are leaving. I will not return. You're lost. 
You've strayed from the path. And you are no Jedi. You! Oh, I got him! Damn! What way to go out? Force hallucination, fueled by fear. I use his against him. <clears throat> Not so scary now. It's still in one piece. BD? Give me some good news. Maybe Dagon was right. Hmm? <laughs> you sure you're not still, uh, you know? <clears throat> Think about it. Tantalor's a fortress. We should use it for the hidden path. Gather allies, train. They'd never see us coming. I don't know, that seems risky. Everything is at risk, so long as the Empire is around. Besides, you don't want Kata spending her whole life in hiding, do you? If she's safe, Cal? Then yeah. Yeah, I'll take that. Yeah. Yeah, okay, I understand that. But someday, someone's gonna have to face the Empire. Why not us? I bet Cordova can fix this up. Let's head back to Jeddah. Back to Jeddah then. Sure. I'm gonna take a look around first. See if I can find a manual for that thing or something. <laughs> we'll figure it out. Yeah. Hey, buddy. You saved my neck. Again. Thanks. It all BD. All right. Hey, like this. Complexity. Hopefully we can just take elevators all the way back to the uh, ship. That'd be nice. Because this was a big old place. <clears throat> Wait, this was on the um, Cobra. We're actually quite far away from the ship. Miles away from the ship. Then we want to jump on this.
Hey. We want to bring this guy right. We should have that. Okay, there's a rest point here. I wonder. I need to center myself. Can we, um. We need to go back to uh, Jeddah. Let's pick our next destination. <clears throat> I'm for Jeddah. Is Bode back on? No, you are, buddy. Think Cordova can repair that compass. I hope so. Oh, I bet credits he can. You have credits to bet? What's that supposed to mean? Tantalor. We're so close now. I'm excited to see Tantalor. Oh, me too. But just don't go starting a witch school or something. I definitely don't invite those creepy sisters of yours. But they're here now, Grease. All around you. <laughs> I just sensed something, Grease. Did you feel that? Are you kidding me? Nope. Buckle in, Cal. Time you got to it. This way. Hello, Master Cordova. Dagangara had the last compass, but it's damaged. He didn't exactly hand it over. This can be repaired. <laughs> I'll begin at once. BD. Let's give Master Cordova some time to concentrate. I know a place with a view. Good. Anybody wanted to give me a hand? Of course, Green. Nice. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, ha ha, very funny. Oh. Okay, here you go. Round two. What do you think? It's strong. It's very sweet. You'll get used to it. <clears throat> you see her. Why don't you join us on Tantalor? There's no better home for the archive or the hidden path. Whatever the future holds, we can face it together. Yes. 
It's a new path for all of us. Cal, Master T'Pol would be proud of the Jedi you've become. Thank you. I had a good teacher. Everyone, the hidden path has found a new home. Titanalor. Titanalor. <laughs> hey, wait a minute, Seer. Does that mean you're coming? Yes, Grease. Oh. <laughs> In fact, about to I'm going to go and prepare the archive for relocation. Well, it's getting late. I'll go with you. Say, where is the Manus in there? This place is terrifying at night. I will escort you. Oh, great. But, hey, none of that creepy stuff, okay? <laughs> Seer, are the Anchorage really coming with us? Of course, yes. Wow, our family's growing with a boatload of creepy aunts and uncles. <laughs> What about you, bud? Are you coming? We did it, Boat. Yeah. The compass is gonna be good as new. Something's bothering you. <clears throat> ah, you know me too well, Scrapper. Just thinking about Kata. And people looking after her, but... It's always a bit tough when I come back. When she sees what you've done for her, she'll understand. I hope so. I know so. I was thinking maybe we should go to Ten War first. Just make sure it's safe before the others join. Mm, the sooner we get the hidden path set up there, the better. Gotta stay one step ahead of the Empire, right? Yeah. Hey. Tomorrow we're gonna have a new home. I couldn't have done that without you, Boat. Thank you, brother. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. I'm, uh, <clears throat> gonna go record a bedtime story for Kata. You have a good night. You What's up with them? What a view, huh? Desert at night seems to stretch on forever. Hmm. And there is beauty and emptiness. Now you sound like a Jedi. You got a few things, right? Not everything. Look, um, the order's gone. It's time to leave it behind. And I know what I want now. Uh. Took you long enough. You take it. Yo guys, we are going to be leaving things here for this episode. If you have enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. Most importantly, go and have yourselves a beautiful day and bye-bye.